hey guys so today i'm going to do just a quick video just talking about kim cam's new crib and um bringing his crib into his room and how we plan to transition to him from his bassinet that's in our room into his room so i'm going to show you guys first um when i got the bed when i put it together when we first set up the room i changed the room a little bit and then put kim kim in his bed and see how he liked it and then i'll just go back over um again on all the little things that we changed and the things that I brought in. So, yeah. And Cam Cam is down here playing. Cam Cam, say hi. Focus on my Cam Cam. Cam Cam, say hi. <laughs> hey guys, I just put together Cam Cam's new crib and I love it. Got the crib from Jocelyn Maine and then I got the mattress. It's a standard crib size Serta mattress. Um, from Macy's so they were having a sale so I got all these are really good price <laughs> it's a very high quality sturdy like crib we didn't want to spend too much on it and I wanted something very, very simple and minimal. I didn't want anything bulky um, and we'll take up, look at my hands from building this crib. <laughs> I didn't want anything bulky or um, yeah, anything bulky or just too, too big that will just take up so much room, um, so much space in the room and stuff like that. And as I said, I wanted it very minimal, a very simple looking crib and exactly what it is like I love it so inexpensive there's so many cute cribs out here that are like minimal but they're like expensive for no reason but um, I searched high and low and I found this great deal so yay! I guess could have put on the crib um, bed sheet and then I'll show you guys how it looks all right so I actually got this um, this sheet let me close this window that's better um, from it's actually a mattress pad so it's a little bit more soft for cam cam um this mattress is firm but it's not it's not it's firm but it's not the firmest but um and i wanted to get i think it's foam when i was looking for mattresses there was like coil and then the foam but i wanted to get the foam i didn't want to get the coils um and then I got this mattress pad. I'm supposed to just make the mattress a little bit more, the sleeping surface a little bit more like plushy, soft, softer. Got this from Target. And then I got the cutest sheets from Target. I actually wanted to buy sheets from Amazon, but the way Amazon is with um, during this Corona time, it's like so slow. So. I usually like to order things that are come the same day I order or like the next day. So there was none that was coming soon. So I just said, let me just get a Target. So um, Target only had one brand of sheets for cribs, but at least they were cute. So I just washed them. So um, this is like a fox and forest print and then uh, f um, like zoo animals gray print. So I think I'm going to do the fox print first. thing about um crib sheets and stuff is that they make them extra extra fitted so that there's no chance that um the the sheets will like roll up or anything or come off the corners um for various for safety reasons so they fit very tight <laughs> done oh my gosh it's so cute one thing about the crib is that i wanted them to have a lot of room for adjustment for heights so a majority of the cribs had two levels, but this crib had three, which I really wanted this three level crib. And then also um, the mattress is the thickest, I think allowed for a standard crib mattress, which is six inches um, like thick. So I wanted the thickest mattress and then I also wanted the most adjustment. Ah, oh, it's perfect. So this bed, it's a four in one. So it's um, a baby crib. It turns into a toddler bed. And then it can be a twin and I think a twin and a full, full size. 
right yeah twin in a full size i think that's the foreign one so yeah so um um as long as the quality stays for a while hopefully we'll be able to be converting to the next stages and stuff so um so far so good i love the grip so i'll have daylight and this more time um because chris will be carrying cam cam on the weekend so i can like organize this room because i think i want to move this um dresser the change table to this wall and then put the crib on this wall so that's the plan so um yeah I, 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 can never really understand what's going on. Mm -hmm. But he looks so good that I feel like he'll react to it. Yeah, he'll notice. He'll yeah, notice it. He'll change. like react to it like oh I mean even just show him, not even put him, just bring him like yeah. he would like yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like yeah, your boy. new bed, Cam Cam? Hmm? Look, you just look at everywhere. Yeah. Do you like your new bed? Give me babies. It's all yours, okay? It's all yours. Now you can roll around as much as you want. Mm -hmm. There you yeah. go. He's feeling it. Yeah. Give me, give me, give me. Let's go. You like your new crib? <laughs> Stand up. Stand up. <laughs> you like your new crib? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> set it up so I'm gonna show you guys again in daylight it's a little bit clear and I'm gonna do it vlog style all right so let me show you how the room looks when you come in so disclaimer this room is actually just a regular guest room that we set up to be like my filming room and then cam cams um, room like with his change table here and then his crib here um, we're not yet set on having this be like completely his room with like you know his own decor and stuff like that but eventually we'll get there but for now it's going to be a very multi-purpose room all right so this is our guest bed um right here and i used the bed and like you know this area as like my filming backdrop so that's why it's kind of like you know feminine style for like a boy's room so this is ken cam's corner here so this is his change table. So you guys know that I actually have 
um, a video on how I set up his change table when he was born. So you can check that out. Um, I'll put that down below. But first, this was actually on this side and this wall was empty. So we brought the crib in and we wanted to put the crib on this wall here. And then we just moved the change table to this side. So it's still the same setup with the change table and everything like that. Um, so we moved his um, diaper pail over here, trash can here, laundry baskets over here, and then his crib is here. So yeah, so I'll show you how it looks from this corner. So I love this room because it's big, spacious, and the reason why we wanted to get a really simple, un, um, really simple and not too bulky of a <laughs> camp camp. <laughs> Did you do poopies? <laughs> um, we didn't want a bulky crib. Want it very simple, just for a good classic taste that can um, stand the test of time um, with styles and with other babies, decor, all that stuff. And we didn't want something to be too bulky that would take up a lot of space in the room. So we want something, went with something very simple and chic. So this is the crib we got. It's a Delta Children's Crib from Jocelyn, Maine. Easy to put together. It's white wood, so it's very sturdy. Um, the price was price point was very good. I didn't want to spend too much on a bed. I didn't want to spend more than one fifty on a crib, and um, but I didn't want something to be very cheap. But luckily, this was good price and very sturdy. Very, 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 very sturdy. Very well made. Um, these sheets are from um, Target. There's Cam Cam. And then um, this is actually from Ikea. Um, it's actually a dresser that we turned into a change station. And then as I said, the video I did on this whole setup and everything I got will be down below. So you, guys, so you can have that direct link of like where I got everything and stuff. Uh, but yeah, so that's it. I'll link the crib. Oh, the mattress. I actually got the mattress from Macy's. I didn't want to spend too much on a mattress, but I wanted it to be very high quality. We went with a Sealy. A mattress baby mattress want something high quality but not too expensive so we actually had it found a sale on macy's that had a crib i mean a mattress yeah. and i was gonna buy all this stuff on amazon but with this whole corona stuff amazon isn't shipping like fast so i wanted something now 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 so macy's and jocelyn Maine had very good shipping time so that's why we went with that so cammy cam cammy 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 all right, so right now um, we have the crib here for daytime napping so Cam Cam can get used to like the crib, the room, sleeping in here, all that. And then at nighttime he still sleeps in his bassinet in our room. And in my video of my newborn setup, I showed you guys like the bassinet that we use. So check that out if you want to know the bassinet that we use. Um, I love it. So at nighttime, so in the bassinet, daytime naps here. So we'll give it a week. Cam Cam. you kick all your toys away okay let go of my pants <laughs> okay all right so um what? okay you want to be in the video okay so we'll give it a week where we'll get him used to his crib and then after a week then we'll do nighttime sleeping in here too and see how he does so yeah so that's a quick video on how we're transitioning from bassinet to crib and how we set up his room and stuff so cam cam do you have anything to say anything to say cammy is that a cammy baby is that a cammy baby <laughs> all right so we'll see you guys in our next video bye cam cam say bye We'll see you guys. Bye.